Taurus, how you doing? Good morning. I definitely keep hearing good morning, Britain, or someone from Britain, or called Brittany, or Brian, uh, or Beth, B, anybody getting with B. Uh, but it's been a while, because I keep hearing, I keep hearing for you, like, uh, I haven't heard from you in a while. Amber, <laughs> but it could be dealing with a life path seven, or Johnny, I don't know. Uh, Amber heard, or I haven't heard anybody from you. So Amber light, green light, red light. So you could be dealing with anyone from the red light, Red light district could be from Amsterdam or anything like that, or it could be a Cancerian or a Life Path 7 that you're dealing with. Uh, okay, Taurus, how you doing? So just a very quick spiel. We uh, channel, we do remote viewing, a picture, channel uh, something through a picture, channel a load of messages, and then we deal with the tarot and all of that kind of stuff. Uh, so, uh, yeah, and you can also watch this, sorry, as a Sagittarian, a Life Path 5, but we are doing Taurus. If you don't understand about numerology, or how that works, you'll need the teaching tier that I'll tell you about at the end on the new website. But um, I, I definitely keep hearing something about, oh, it's been a while, I haven't seen or heard from you in a while, where have you been? And someone could have got lost, I don't know, it could be a Virgo or a Life Path 9, and it feels like that someone could have gone walkabout, and it might be someone from Australia, but like, man, it's been a long time since I've seen you, you haven't been around for a while. <laughs> so uh, I don't know unless this is family, and it's kind of like, oh my God, I'm just popping over to see the family, it's like, my God, you've been gone for ages, I haven't seen you for ages. It could even be where you're catching up with an old friend or something or something like that and uh, you haven't seen this person in a very long time. Okay, uh, but for a lot of you, this really could just be relating to like a, a message of, the, say, that you go to see your parents or you go to meet the parents and you haven't seen them in a long time and you sit there and you have a catch up with Gabby or Abby or Abigail or Amber or Amber Heard and I haven't seen you in a long time and uh, it's good to catch up <laughs> is really what I'm keeping up. Now, catch, it might be something to do around a Pisces or a Life Path 3 because that would be catching something in a net. I'm also hearing Natalie, uh, a net or inet or... Uh, in, in native native okay so it's changing now some of you might be into or your partner might be into native instruments okay native instruments for all you guys that do anything around mixing and mastering music production because it seems to have a lot of people that are all kind of like artsy and crafts so definitely keep people like, like native instruments you might be buying and selling and you've come from the other channeled message that was for the musicians that were all to do with guitar pedals foot pedals in synthesizers guitars I was hearing cynthia sarah steve sassy uh synther sizer uh sizer sizer miser wiser something to do around a wise man someone might be very wise influential and some kind of like a entrepreneur type sort of uh energy like i'm too wise okay uh Jai, I'm also hearing Jai's, Jai's, Jason, Julian, Jason, Justin, Jackie, Jasmine, J they come up in every single channel message, Jackie, uh, definitely Jay's, I'm, I'm hearing more Jack or Jackie or Jackson, though, Jackie's, like son, these come up in other messages, these are your sons or daughters, I feel, for a lot of you, like you're watching this and you've got a son or a daughter, okay, that is whatever star sign, but you're probably watching it uh, because of their placement or yours, um, yeah, so I keep hearing Jackson, my son, my Biden, so it's with Biden, so Biden is what, Scorpio, Life Path 4, Aries, you could be dealing with one of those, um, Biden, my time, time, anyway, hold on a second, what else has Taurus got coming up that is influence, influential, some sort of influencing, influencing, I don't know if it's under the influence of drugs or alcohol, if you know anybody around you that is, like under the influence of alcohol or drugs, or is just a bit coherent at the moment. I'm also hearing someone that's also hard of hearing, like they might be deaf, they could even be called Steph, Stephanie, Steve, Sarah, but like deaf, like I said, what? <laughs> like I can't hear so well anymore. Some of you, I'm picking up people that may be elderly here, like elderly, I mean, you might even look after them in a nursing home. I don't know, but like people that are very hard of hearing or just don't listen at all. Okay, so now the messages are changing. You really could have a stubborn and arrogant person. Definitely if you're dealing with like Taurus, Scorpio, Life Path 4, Taurus. Not so much Sag, but like Taurus, Scorpio, 4s. Kind of like someone at a Laws, Laura, Lucy, Lucifer, a Capricorn, which would be a slash Gemini. Don't forget, we deal in numerology, so I'm going to be changing and saying a lot of things uh, here. There's also someone that talks a lot, but isn't talking to it. Okay, hold on. Where's the message coming from here? 
talks a lot. Okay, talk, 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 talk. And for some reason, it seems, unless you're getting a new mobile phone and you're on an internet provider of talk, talk, but I'm hearing like, I don't want to talk because you talk. <laughs> because you talk too much or you're always wanting to talk, I don't want to talk. Okay, man, y'all really could be getting into some kind of like fucking bind here, Taurus. Because I'm hearing talking, not talking, then we're talking, then we're not talking, then we are talking, then we're not. I talk a lot and not something around a Piscean. Okay, so it could be your son or daughter or anybody. But like, uh, talk, 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 talk. I'm talking to you, but I don't want to talk to you. I'm talking, not talking. Oh, man. What is it around communication at the moment? I mean, is it like uh, retrograde at the moment? Communication breakdown? Or are you dealing with lead or Zeppelin or anybody beginning with L? Laura, Lucy, Louise, uh, Linda. Bel Linda and Belinda. <laughs> All right. <laughs> but like, uh, yeah, I definitely keep hearing like, I haven't spoke to you in a while. And it's a little bit like a parent that meets up with someone like, man, I haven't spoke to you in ages. Where have you been? You've been gone and you're not come back. And, and then I'm kind of getting this message of like, well, I'm not talking to you. <laughs> so is this where it's a different message around a family kind of group message of like, you talk too much, you never listen, you never change, you don't do anything. It's got to be around like Scorpio. Man, y'all guys, like if you know, you know me, I always tell you the truth. If you've got an opposition of like, say, a Scorpio rising, okay, and it's someone around you that might be so like a Taurus rising and anybody in your life and you are having that, like that big conflict with all the time and you just can never seem to like, but you're always butting heads, you're always kind of like in each other's way. It feels like that, right? It feels like the same kind of message that you guys always get that may be around your love interest or a sibling or a partner, okay? But uh, it's here yet again, okay? Again, Jen, you're right, Jen. <laughs> you ain't like that, Jen, are you? Jen's gone down on something. She couldn't find the button to press when she went down, apparently. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, so, yeah, are you having an argument with a partner here and you're not speaking to someone, right? We're not even speaking, we're not even talking, we're not even getting on with a Ron or Rachel or Ricky or anybody beginning with R or Lars, Lars, Laws, no Laws, Laws, Laura, Laws, someone that's called Laws, so like Lara or Laura or someone that's Crofts, called Crofts, um, mm, Taurus, <laughs> Taurus, have we got anything, thing, Steve, Stephen? Taurus, 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 quick, any messages for Taurus? Well, talking a lot and not talking. So it's a mixed message between both. It's kind of like a love interest that is talking and then they're not. They don't want to speak and then they do. One minute they're changing their mind and then they're not. And then they are and then they're not. And then you are and then you're not. But I will tell you this if you want to be educated in tarot to everybody. Okay. I can, uh, the name Gary or Tina, I can guarantee you, guarantee you this, okay, as wisdom and advice of someone that is wise. When you watch tarot card readings, if you have someone that you are or are not speaking to, I can 100% guarantee you that when that person or if that person was to see this reading or any other they would look at it and see it the same way as you do. I can guarantee you that, right? That's 100% to always make sure that when you're watching tarot, your partner that you are arguing or sibling that you are arguing with when you get into these not speaking, not talking, you can't make up your mind up, you're not, I am, you in, I am, you're not, are you right, I am? But like, I'm not speaking to you, you're speaking to me, I'm not. When you get into those binds and those triangles, you are, you are, you will both see each other where, say, like, if you was to send this reading to your partner, right? Don't do that. <laughs> but if you did, and they was to watch it, and that was the person that you have arguments with, they would see it as if they was to sit here, they would go, yeah, fucking hell, that's you. And you go, what do you mean that's me? Like, yeah, that's you. You do that all day long. You change your mind, and you can never, right, make up your mind on what you're doing. Or like, no, 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 Michael or Melissa or Maria, Michael, Jackson, Julian, Jason, Justin, Jackie, Gemini. Gemini, Emily, Melissa, Maria, like, no, it was you, no, no, it wasn't, it was you, no, because you would get into that, I guarantee you, <laughs> right, so when you're watching Tarot, it's always best to keep in mind that when you have an opposition of when you're arguing and speaking, that your partner would see it the way they see it, and so would you, and if you've got conflict, you would both see it the same, the same, okay, because of blame, when you have an argument, someone's blaming you for something, okay, for Scorpio or Aries. They blame you for something, so you're shouting and screaming. You, as a defensed energy, will stick up for yourself to say, no, it isn't, I don't do all of those kind of things, it's because you said this, blah, blah, blah. 
So if you're both watching it, or you both do it, okay, you're both going to watch the same reading with exactly the same outcome. We are speaking, we're not speaking, we are talking, we're not talking, we're kind of coexisting, we're sort of on the verge of it's your fault, it's your fault, it's not my fault, you do this, you do that, I don't, you do, yes you do, no I don't. Okay, so you're in conflict, whichever way I, I see it. Now, for a lot of you, if none of these relate, then make sure that you watch the rest of the reading and then come back and you tell me, guarantee me, that if any of these ever come up, you say, oh, fuck, and you go back and you think, well, it wasn't that way, but it is now. <laughs> okay, so what I am picking up for you is conflict arising in the rising. So they're saying in the rising. So if you've got, like, it's rising up. So rising up, uh, back on my feet, Leo. So uh, took my down, took my chances. So I always see that as a Leo card. So you might be dealing with strength. So a Leo or an Aquarian, maybe, and a rising up. So it might be like an eight in the rising, which means an Aquarian rising or a Leo rising. Okay, and then you've obviously got Scorpio and Aries. Uh, so, sorry, Scorpio Taurus. So you could be dealing with those kind of people. Okay. Uh, so if you've got rising up and it's Leo or slash, slash Aquarian, that's a fixed energy within the rising. Okay, so they would rise up to be more fixed and stubborn and arrogant if you're seeing them that way at this moment. Okay, because they're going through something. You've probably had an argument. You're not speaking. You're more than likely not talking. You're con clashing heads with a Taurian energy as well, and it's all mixed up. And you just can't seem to like where you kind of like you know what I give up. <laughs> right, I give up. Right, I was hearing Jessup, Jesse, James, Jesse. Jessica, also Jessica, or Jessup, 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 um, Jessup, <laughs> uh, anything else for Taurus coming through, any other messages that you want Taurus to be aware of, beware of the big bad wolf, so a wolf would be a, I don't know, a Leo, beware of the big bad wolf, beware, beware, be, or wear, something to do with wearing off. Something's wearing off. I don't know, the effect, and it's wearing off. I don't know what that is, unless it's clothes, and I'm wearing something off, like a new suit. <laughs> uh, wearing off, it's wearing off. Well, that wouldn't be witchcraft, because I don't believe in it, uh, unless you do, but I'm hearing something's wearing off. Wearing off, it isn't working anymore. I don't know, man. At the moment, I keep picking up this conflict. It isn't working anymore. Okay, I just give up, man. I, I, it's not working. So you might even... <laughs> brother, this is your love life. You might even be splitting up. I mean, it's kind of like this. Oh, it isn't working anymore, man. I keep trying to work it, and I keep trying to do it, and it isn't doing anything. Is that, I mean, I, if this is a diet or anything like that, guys, don't give up, right? Don't, <laughs> don't give up. But, like, if it's a diet or anything like that, don't give up, right? If you've been trying really hard at something, don't just give up, Right? Don't do that, okay? Because trust me, I take my own advice there with my diet. Don't give up, right? Um, but I don't know if this is your love life and you're like, you know what? I just, I give up. I, I, I can't, I, I, someone with an eye, maybe. <laughs> oh, my, my eye is better now. Uh, for you guys that have been asking about my eye, which was red eye or pink eye. Um, but like, I give up with joy. Or like, I just give up, man. I can't keep doing this anymore. Right, I don't want to argue. I don't want to keep bickering. I don't want to go through this. I just give up with you, man. There's no point in keep even trying to get through to you to for you to listen. You don't, okay? Now, if you're not suffering through any of that at all, anything else, if they're not going through that, not. There's a huge energy of Pisces here because when I say not, I normally that is my like Piscean card, not. I mean, <clears throat> I mean, if you're in a third party, we'll get to that. But like, uh, I don't know, is it something around a birthday party? I mean, it'd be Leo's, Leo's birthday party. Is it like a third party or birthday party? I'm kind of picking up here. I'm like, uh, I don't know. I'm hearing like meeting the in-laws or like going to a birthday party and there's going to be people there or, I don't know. I'll be there. Michael Jackson. Something with Michael or Jackie or Julian or Jason. I don't know. Anyway, so, oh my God, what on earth is that? That looks like so <laughs> someone's looking at their member. Jesus, this person's got a big old throbbing member. I mean, look at the size of that, bless them. <laughs> I mean, Taurus, I mean, someone here's got a big old donkey. I mean, I'm just saying, bruv, even this person's shocked. 
you know, it's kind of like, whoa, look at that. <laughs> it looks a little bit like a dragon, really. Like a, I don't know, like a, uh, what the fuck is that? A dog? I mean, it could be a person. I don't know, but it's kind of like looking at that and saying, my God, look at the size of that thing there. And he's got it right in his hand. So, I don't know, you could be having a good old time of something. Um... What on earth else is that, man? Because <laughs> what else could that be? Um, I'm <laughs> I'm astonished by the size of this person's dingle. <laughs> uh, what else are we got here? I mean, it's kind of like looking at the same thing, really. Someone's astonished by the size of something. I don't know. Like, look at the size of it. I mean... You know, uh, I mean, if you've got a dog and it's lipstick, I mean, it's your dog's lipstick might be coming out and you go, oh, bless it, it's just stuck. Or like uh, someone, you know, has horses and you're kind of like, look at the horse, like, whoa, where did that come from? I mean, it actually, it does look like a horse. So some of you might be doing like horse training or you've got horses, okay, ducks and chickens and horses, but I'm definitely seeing this as like a horse's head here and the horse is kind of like so you might be like mating horses or like uh doing some <laughs> doing something around that you know let the horse see the ferret you know and this little ferret is going please no oh god blimey mary don't do that <laughs> so uh i don't know what this just turn it round. oh man i can't get the same image out of my head hold on a minute taurus let me know what you see anyway right lucy but let me know what it is that you see uh taurus so man let's get that image out of my head um i can't there's something forming here but i've got no i mean it looks like the same thing i mean you could have someone <laughs> on one end you could have two people right you could have one that's like that and they're like blessed and like well you know what you're definitely blessed in that department and then you perhaps have another one and you're like well you're not so blessed as the other one <laughs> so and you're kind of like well like you know are you going to take this or what and you're like well i could take it but i don't really want to but like and you're like well do you want to take that then and you're like fuck actually that's the same i think that would hurt so i don't know i mean like i said man y'all could be just enjoying yourself and you go hello madam would you like this and you're like nah you got anything bigger and you're like yep I want that one, and you're like, oh, Jesus. He's like, yep, that's new in today. We just got that in. That's the new product. And you're like, oh, Jesus Christ, man. I think I'm definitely going to take a gander at that. So some of you might have got yourself a new product or a new toy or something like that. <laughs> it's definitely what I'm picking up for you girls that like, you know, that sort of thing. Um, unless it's a Steve or a thing. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> what on earth is going on in these pictures, man? Because, oh, okay. Whoa. Does anybody see that? That is a dragon's mouth. <laughs> there you go. There's the, the chin. There's the chin. There is the tongue area. There's probably the tongue. And then it goes round and his, oh, his mush is all a little bit like Kuif there. But that's a dragon's nose. Okay. And then you got around here. So that looks like an animal of such. Okay. An animal. Um, can you see it? Okay, so like I said, I mean, I don't know, it could be a dog's mouth, a cat's mouth, an horse's head, a dragon. I don't really know. It could even be like I am, which is year of the dragon. But like, uh, so yeah, here. <laughs> here I am. So that's a big mouth. So someone could have a big mouth. And you're like, bruv, will you please just shut your mouth? You've got such a big mouth. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Is that relating to anything? That might be a message for you of a an animal of such because it could like i said it could also still be a horse or something like that okay <laughs> that's really what i'm picking up and then it's kind of like looking at it what is that hold on so that's a mouth and a horse and then this way is the same kind of image right of the actual so it's it's going from that close up to that so is it like photography or something? And that is like an extreme close-up, okay? And then that is like something to do with like a GoPro or a camera. And that is like extremely close-up. And then this is like more in the distant energy here, okay? So these could be even two people that you got. This one's like really close to you. And this one's like, 
I don't know. I can't really work out too many messages of what that is relating to, to you, Taurus. Uh, but there you go. How you doing? Anyway, so new merchandise is in the shop for each and individual 12 star signs. Taurus, you've got a good one, actually. Okay, but it's in the shop. Okay, all links provided below. I'll tell you about the move because you've probably heard about it soon. Uh, so, let's see. Um, heard, Amber. Something I keep hearing Amber Heard. She is a Taurus, but I keep hearing the name. Anyway, so let's see. Um, Taurus, 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 Taurus. What have they got coming up, please? This week, Taurus, what have they got coming up? Please give them a good one. So you could be doing the Life Path 7, a Cancerian, looking forward to having some time off work and traveling. You could be going abroad. You could be very, 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 very busy. And if you're not, this person is. If you do not have transport, this person does. This person could also work for transportation or company. Okay, so they might work for a taxi company. They might work for anywhere where it involves uh, products being sold and transported. Okay, it could even be Jason, uh, Jason from Transport, Jason whatever his name is, <laughs> in Transport. Transport. Um, but like um, something to do with like I'm waiting for on a delivery, or your partner is, and something is going to be delivered. Actually, I am today. I've got. It should be coming very soon. It's more gel pads for the bionic gym for you guys that are into fitness and can't move. You find it very painful. Follow the vlog, and I'm going to do you a very good product. Okay, that will. Uh, you'll you'll be astounded by how many calories you can lose just by standing up for an hour. But anyway. Something is possibly being delivered or you're waiting for it or your partner is. It might be a bye and you're waiting on a delivery, okay? But there seems to be a hell of a lot of things going on where I'm trying to get going and motivated to go forward. I want to continue on the path that I'm on, but do you? Because if you've got conflict, this partner will back off and say, no, I'm not going on that path. This path is already done. I've decided on another one. OK, so it's kind of like this energy that seems to be creeping through of one message about waiting on a delivery. OK, you might even work for a transportational company that delivers products like DBS or uh, I don't know. OK, or you work for a company that sells cars. So a sale or Sally or Sally Ann. But like I'm waiting on a uh, to buy a car, have a car fixed or go on a journey and a trip and go abroad or away for a while, but it will more than likely only be a car's journey. And some of you are waiting on products to sell, okay? I don't think it would be cars, but I'm picking up selling products, okay? Um, selling out, selling out. Um, well, that might even be told to get out. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, there's a lot to do with around this travelling of possible arguments I'm picking up around, like, going out. Like, just being picking me up. Uh, Taurus, what have they got coming up for August? Taurus, so you got Gemini, Capricorn placements possible, caring, loving mother, or a caring, loving person, or the name Karen, or Karen. I used to work in a place with a person called Karen and what we did, which is what is in this card. So it's getting me to look at people that work possible 12 hour shifts. There's two energies, someone that also works as a delicatessen that serves people each day as they come into a shop. You're right, uh, Michelle. <laughs> but like they come into a shop, a vape shop or anybody's vaping. I'm actually vaping a new juice at the moment. But like a vape shop, a clothes shop, a any shop where it's buying in products. You might work there or you could work for the elderly and the NHS and the health support, mental health uh, condition or looking for help or working there. OK, elderly residents of people that work for the elderly of a nurse that provides medication for people. Some of you might be on medication itself for something that could have gone on in your life. Whatever that may be, you could well be taking medication. A lot of people also take medication. Okay, now I'm hearing dedication is what you need. The person that sung that and did that in Britain was called Roy Castle. Roy, okay, or Castle or Castleton. Okay, man, here we go with the messages. Keep up. Castleton, Rock, something from up north. Sheffield, Manchester, Leeds, Castleton, 
would also be Castleton, Derbyshire, uh, Scotland. Okay, so those places you might be traveling, going to, or from. Then I'm also hearing uh, Castle Roy Castle, someone that uh, <coughs> that works in an elderly unit, and then also um, uh, what was the last message? Uh, Roy, uh, sorry, yeah, the cancer. Someone that may have lost to a, the battle to cancer or is fighting the battle of cancer here. Now, it might be somewhere around the family is either lost a cancerian and they're grieving, or this is taking medication for the signs of cancer or looking or going for a smear test or anything around tests that is to do with doctors and hospitals or anything that is vaginal is also what i'm hearing okay so like checking up a checkup vaginal checkup smear test smear campaign if someone's slating someone uh, also asking for slate now slate in the uk is either one dog bar which was a bit of tuk tuk herb okay but it was dog bar so it's solid but slate is also a can i buy it but not have it <laughs> can I have it on slate which means can I have it on tick basically can I have the product without paying for it and I'll pay for it next week okay or next month so like credit credit rating credit scores credit cards on slate can't afford it haven't got the money yet but can I have it and pay next week next month so you might be paying those off or asking for something where it's paid bit by bit pay as you go <clears throat> so you might even be buying something that you really want and it is on a pay as you go basis 12 month 6 month or 3 month might even be on a six month basis okay six month basis as a pay as you go okay so there is also for people that may be in the family suffering from signs of cancer or did have it and is now nursing someone back to health okay this would be looking after a person that could have gone through the wars and looking after them for the signs of that okay now that's also grief counseling is also what i'm hearing uh, because this is a doctor in hospital and a mental health practitioner. So it could be ADHD, bipolar or also grief stricken by something that has happened in someone's life. OK, it's also what I'm picking up for a lot of you. Now, if you were to look at this generically, OK, just kind of like, OK, I'm not channeling. I'm not picking up any messages that don't relate to cards. Basically, you are just providing uh, a service looking after people you have a car you more than likely have children you have your own transport blah 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 so on and so forth and you're going to and from work and you might work as a person that looks after children and you put your children in daycare and stuff like this and this person might be Colin or day or works at a daycare center okay okay so let's see Taurus what have they got coming up please for August Taurus what they got coming up for August there you go so there's the picture <laughs> just saying bruv you're all right if you can see me down there okay let's relate it okay there you go that has to be the picture <laughs> that will probably be a, a a thumbnail for you guys okay <laughs> but there you go it's a surprise there's a monster in my pocket <laughs> now there is a surprise bundle if you want something big <laughs> okay or you could be called tom or hanks or that other word that begins with w uh, or wayman or anybody that's got a w in their name somewhere um but yeah bundles that i'm offering people but you've probably seen the video by now uh i'll tell you about it at the end okay like a big bundle a big bundle of joy it might even be your child here Let's see. Don't go. Don't walk into their room. Cool. No, God, no. Oh, no, don't do that. Because I keep picking up someone walking into someone's room. And you're like, what are you doing? Uh, just having a wash. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> why, uh, it's, why it's just taking a shit. <laughs> Brian, you've been in there all day. It's like you got the water running. <laughs> I never tossed off. <laughs> Anybody seen weird science? <laughs> uh, let's see um taurus taurus what they got coming up for the month of august man when you're in love with a man i mean you can't deny it pam 
Okay, if you if you ain't in love with someone, man, you're just like going about your jolly little way. Like you know, you're just enjoying like freedom, freedom of speech, freedom of money. Have a house, have a home, have a car. You know, everything seems to be going gravy, man. I am so glad that you've got a good reading at the moment, Taurus, because let's face it, bruv, if you've been following my channel, I haven't been able to pick up on a decent message for Taurus or Sat. Well, Taurus, Sag, Life Path Five energies for a while. Now, like I said, man, if you're watching, you're thinking, well, well, I live shit, Steve, and it's going down the toilet. Well, this person's happy. <laughs> you know, like I said, you can watch this from your other person's perspective if you want. And you can say, what's going on with my partner? Well, this, if that's, if someone's feeling shit and down and annoyed, well, this person isn't. This person's quite calm, relaxed and chilled. And they're in love or want to be, okay? Might even be Mel C. Who knows, right? <laughs> right, but like, you know, scary spies but you know like i said this person's happy as they are with or without you or with you so if you're not well then you need to sort yourself out <laughs> now if you're happy together like oh we want to be together and you're from dudley or somewhere like that or Kennick, okay um but like um yeah man someone's happy as larry that's your name's larry lara laura let's see um you make me happy when skies are blue. What's her in David Gray? Um, whew, man, I mean, when the sun is fucking shining, Taurus, let's have it, bruv. You know, let's have it. Do you want it? Go on, do you want it? Go on, do you want that? Yeah, I do. I'll have it. Go on, then. You can take it off my hands if you want. <laughs> it's going once, going twice, sold to the nearest bidder. Some of you might work at an auction yard or something like that. You're like, cool, bruv, I'll take that off your hands for that price. You're like, go on then, Joey. Go on, I'll have it. Go on then. Yeah, I'll buy that. Some of you might even buy it for a dollar. I mean, like I said, man, if you're involved in my new website that I've been designing over the last couple of days, man, I am offering you fucking chip loads of stuff, Taurus. You can rent, buy individual readings. You can have bundles of teaching stuff, weeklies and monthlies. You can have a bundle of monthly 12 signs where they're all sent to you and you can rent them out for a month or a week. You can you can have a surprise bundle. You can join a subscription. You can have what we add over on Patreon at cheaper prices. You can have the lot, Taurus. All you have to do is look below. <laughs> but it's kind of like that. Going once, going twice. Do you want that? Like, cool, bruv, I'll have that. I'll take that off your hands, right? <laughs> so this is kind of like, well, if you don't want me, someone will snap it up. Now, it could be a whipper snapper. I don't know, it could be a fish or something, but like, well, I'll take that off your hands. So, I mean, I am actually selling stuff at the moment. Quite a lot of stuff, actual products as well, because I'm a musician. So I'm actually selling a few of my uh, older uh, MIDI keyboards that I kind of don't use anymore. But uh, anyway, buying and selling merchandise in love with a person or in love with myself. This person could be selfish. You could see them as arrogant. And I ain't kidding. You know, having resenting the person for feeling loved and wanted <laughs> that's willing it just depends if the other party is you know you can watch a reading and say well i'm watching this and it's great but i don't feel it and you're like well it doesn't have to be you it can relate to the partner that you're connected with someone's getting on really well someone's knocking at your door right john someone's ringing your bell anyway let's see taurus what's going on with taurus uh, month of August, you see, man, everything, all of a sudden, just as it starts to go, well, Justin, or Julian, Jason, Justin, Jackie, Jasmine, let's build you up, buttercup, and let's just knock you down because you're a centre of attention and you're an arsehole, because you always require too much attention. <laughs> so we've got multiple messages coming out now, Taurus, because we have one card in reverse that seems to have ruined the whole lot. Surprise! Oh, really? Is that all I got? <laughs> Hopefully that's not my bundle. But like, uh, like I said, it could be happening in the family. It could be someone that is always requiring too much of your attention. Or it could be resentment because you work or you love and you want me, but you don't give me enough attention. So you could have an attention seeker that isn't happy with this. That's what I said, Taurus. Things can change. You've got to watch your own behavior. And I'm not kidding because you could be Sagittarius, Taurus, Life Path 5. And this could be you, but this could be you. Okay, so don't let the okey don't fool you. <laughs> okay, someone here is happy knocking at your door, which means that I'm happy to come and see you. I'm happy to come and visit. I'm happy to be here and I'm happy to just be alive and for you to be my partner. But no, 
But no, there's always a but, and always what Steve used to say is everything after but is bollocks. Yeah, but, no, but, yeah, bollocks. What is going on with this card in reverse? Ron, Ricky, Rachel, Richard, Evans, Barry, Tina. Why is this person requiring more attention than what they've got? Here, come on, tell me in the comments below. Who is it around you that requires too much attention? Even when you're giving them it. Hmm? Now is it, because it's a quality, it's a six, Gemini or Capricorn. But it can be either way. Don't forget you got two of them. you got one here and one here. Which means I'm willing to give you the attention that you want. And I've given you loads of attention. I've given you money. I've given you support. I've given you a car. Or I've picked you up. I've took you here. I've even took you to work when you haven't got your own car. I come and pick you up and I take you to work and your place of residency. I pick you up, I take you left, right, centre, forward, backwards. I come and pick you up to bring you to me. We go out, we travel, we do everything and I do everything because I love you and I have a car and I can do that. Because I have great opportunities in life that may be around that I have a good job and that allows me to do all of these kind of things to be free and to have a car and a nice house and a home. And I love you, Janay. And I love you and I want to be with you. And there it is. But no, that isn't enough. So you have a selfish person that I'm sorry if you're on the batting end of this, but y'all need to listen because it's not anno it's, it's annoying this person. Because if all of this isn't enough, then you're not looking at the bigger picture of life. You're not looking at actually what is given to you. Now, a lot of you, this, what does it turn to? Resentment. Because you work hard, you have a good job, you probably work a 12-hour shift, you probably work quite a lot, you look after people, you care about people, you care about me and yourself. But why, why, I ask, is that still not enough for you? Why is that enough for you? Okay. Hmm. Now, if you ask the other person, they'll probably say exactly what Steve just read out on the tin. You ask for too much, and I resent the fact that you can give me all of that. And I don't like it that you can give me all of that, because they turn into something where they're like, well, I need more attention of what it is that you're not giving to me. So what do you start doing? Arguing. Arguing. Trust me, when people are entrepreneurial, or when people work, okay, now, I've gone through these kind of scenarios in my life constantly. If you are entrepreneurial and you do not work for a company, you have your own company, your own company is much harder to run and have and work at than what it is if you was to work for an employer. The employer will tell you how many days that you're working, how many days that you have off, which means you've got six or seven or eight weeks off this uh, month. Or weeks off this year <laughs> okay would you like to book any holiday off okay here's your package with your doctors and your like your dental practice and we do all of that and give you that but when you are self-employed you have one yourself to motivate and two a lot more work to do because you do not clock in and clock out with a card you do not turn up to a place and go chink plink that's my day over i can go home and now i'm free no if you run your own business, it's a 24-hour business. You get done when you're done, okay, because you work for yourself, okay? Work at home, work for yourself. Some people think, oh, well, you work at home. It must be easier. No, <laughs> no, because when you build a business and you're entrepreneurial, sometimes it can get bigger and bigger and bigger. So what is that? More work, more work, more work, more work, more work. It's getting bigger, it's getting bigger. So is your ego, you have too much work. You don't do. You do too much work. You're never with me. You're always at work. You have too much money and you have too much ego and too much to say. Does that sound about kind of arguments that you get in the way of each other? You're always looking after your children and you don't never have any free time for me. Does that sound like anybody you know? Because the better the devil you know is the one that you actually know the best, and that is normally your partner or a sibling because <laughs> it definitely wouldn't be a fucking stranger, okay? Because if it was and you was to have this conflict with a stranger, then Jesus, man, y'all need to be careful. <laughs> Just saying. 
Anyway, so that's me as a tarot card reader. It's really for entertainment purposes, but it is the truth all the same, and you can either take it or leave it. Hopefully, you're a loyal, lovely uh, Taurus person, and you may want to join my new website. Okay, if you haven't seen the video that I've just posted, I can offer you loads. You have subscription-based stuff that is just the same as what uh, Patreon was, but it's cheaper, okay? There's a bronze, silver, and gold tier. So if you're on the gold tier, for instance, you get all the monthlies, all the weeklies, and all of the teaching and live exclusive Q&As where you can talk with me live if you're a subscribed member to the gold tier. Okay, that's eventually coming up each month. Okay, you can come online, you can do what you like, we can talk, you don't have to, I can answer your questions via whatever, and I can do you a few cuts. So we offer loads of things, you can bundle them up, you can just think, you know what, Steve, I don't really want to join the subscription of the monthlies, I want to join all of it, or I just want the monthly reading. You can buy it separately. Or I want the bundle, which involves a Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus bundle for my monthlies, and I just want three. Steve, can you do me a three-monthly bundle with this reading, another reading, and another one? Okay, there it is. That's how much it is. And you, you get access to the three readings over a period of a week or a month. Or a week. <laughs> so I can offer you loads more. Okay, but I have done a video that will explain all of that. You'll just have to search for it. Okay, I'll probably link it below. Um, but I offer you loads. Now, for the people that are on Patreon, Patreon still remains open until we literally go straight over to the other one. All of the 12 signs that I've done through August have all been downloaded from my own YouTube channel. And this morning I've spent three hours posting them all back up on and pricing them and labeling them on the new website. So eventually I won't have so much work to do because I won't have to keep putting things on Patreon. But I'll let you know about what's going to happen with the end of Patreon. But we have Patreon still for the people that are already subscribed. And if you're new... Okay, and you want to check it out, then you can check out the link provided below over to the website and see, take a gander at it, bruv, see what it offers you, because it could offer you more than you know, okay, and it also really supports me as a channel and a family, okay, all right, guys, I really do appreciate it, Taurus, uh, check out everything provided below, guys, and uh, I will see you very soon.